Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Hope you guys are doing well. So today I'm going to be doing a simple makeup tutorial. Basically, this is a makeup tutorial I have done. So uh, yeah, if you guys are new to my channel, then do not ever forget to hit that subscribe button and also hit that bell icon for future notifications. And if you love this video, then please give this video a big thumbs up and also pass all your messages and comments in the comment section underneath this video. So having that said, let's get into today's video. Let's get started. So I'm starting here with the skincare. I am going to use my favorite toner from Sebamet. I am taking it in a cotton pad and applying it all over my face. I've been using this toner for quite some time now and it has helped me a lot in clearing up my face. So I am applying it evenly onto my face. Now let the toner sit on your face for just 10 minutes so let's get right up. Now applying a moisturizer. This is my favorite chia seed moisturizer from Face Shop. Applying a moisturizer before makeup is really important for you to get a nice canvas now I'm going to gently apply it and massage it really well onto my skin now it's time to moisturize your lips I'm taking the baby lips lip balm from Maybelline and applying it onto my lips done with the skincare I'm going to apply a foundation this is the wet and wild foundation in the shade desert beige uh, this is my f perfect match and I'm taking it and applying it all over my face and then with a wet damp beauty sponge I'm going to blend it evenly onto my face now if you have any doubts regarding the products i'm going to be using in this video then please check the description box everything will be linked in there now i'm going to set my face if you're having oily skin it is a must but if you're having dry skin you can just skip this step i'm taking my favorite nc42 max studio fits powder and then applying it all my face now i'm going to do my eyes i'm taking the nika rock the line kajal and applying it onto the water lines of my eyes this kajal has a decent pigmentation and also can last you for a long time now moving on to the eyeliner i love this eyeliner a lot this is my favorite hyper glossy eyeliner from maybelline this eyeliner is a nice eyeliner for daily use it has a glossy finish but it can last for a long time I am just slightly lining my eyes. Now next thing is mascara. For me it's really important to apply a mascara even if I skip the eyeliner because it can just open your eyes and bring that beauty to your eyes. So I am by the way using the uh, Faces Canada mascara uh, which is the argan oil infused one. Applying it onto my top lashes and my bottom lashes. Now I'm taking a blush. This blush is from Maybelline. This is the Cheeky Glow blush and I'm taking it in a powder brush and applying it onto the apples of my cheek. Now it's time for the highlighter. As I've used a lot of matte products, I really wanted something to be dewy. I use this sugar uh, cosmetics uh, highlighter and applying it onto the cheekbones and bridge of my nose. Now, blending it everything with a setting spray. I'm going to take the Wet n Wild setting spray and with a damp sponge, blending everything into one. That's it guys, we're done with the base. Now I'm going to end it up with a lipstick. This is my favorite lipstick, it's a nude shade and it's a Nykaa lipstick in the shade Naughty Nude. I'm going to be drawing it into my lips and this is actually my lips but better. So with that we complete our makeup look. If you guys love this makeup look then please do comment in, in the comment section and also subscribe to my channel if you are new here. Share it with your friends and family and that's it for this video guys. See you guys in my next video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.